Even though Niu RQI Sport is not a brand new model, since it's been first previewed by the CES exhibition a year ago, this bike is still worth mentioning as it seems the bike is finally ready to launch after such a long delay. The manufacturer has used this year's Milan Motorcycle Show in order to announce the production-ready specifications and an estimated market launch. By the way, it's supposed to happen close to the summer of 2022. The heart of this bike is represented by a 7.5 kilowatt mid-drive electric motor with a chain drive. This motorcycle will top out at the speed of 62 miles per hour, but there's an additional power boost button that can squeeze extra speed and push you to almost 70 miles per hour. It's a nice feature to have in cases when you need to make a quick pass on the highway or have maximum acceleration at your disposal. It should be noted that the power boost feature is limited to 30 seconds or so. Niu RQI Sport draws power from two 70 volt, 36 amp hour battery packs that are expected to provide the estimated range of 75 miles. Besides announcing the estimated market launch date, the manufacturer also suggested an introduction of a more powerful, higher spec model in the future. The world of motocross and dirt bike riding will never be the same. This statement briefly summarizes the recent product presentation by an EV startup that is based in Spain. The development of the next generation electric dirt bike has taken them almost two years. This time was used to implement the latest and greatest innovations in the EV field. These innovations combined with the lightest materials and some of the most energy dense batteries on the market produced an exceptional new product. It's said to be the fastest electric dirt bike of today, as well as have the best power to weight ratio in class. The bike is supplied with two motor options, offering either 44 or 58 kilowatts of output. The power generated by the motors can be controlled via a smartphone application. Even with the most extreme power settings, the bike's battery pack can grant up to 40 minutes of riding, while riding sessions at moderate speeds can last up to six hours. The bike's battery can boast a 6 kilowatt hour capacity while tipping the scales at just 70.5 pounds. Even with the battery installed, the overall weight of this motocross bike is 242.5 pounds, which is similar to classic 450cc models. The bike's innovative powertrain capable of producing 692 pound-feet of torque, so combined with the Kayaba suspension and Brembo brake, this two-wheeler will shine on any dirt trail. Even though V-Moto Soko have already done several significant updates to their electric motorcycle and scooter range this year, the brand continues to innovate and has used the latest Milan Motorcycle Show to reveal one more upcoming model. The two-wheeler is to be brought into motion by powertrain duo consisting of a 6-kilowatt hub motor and a 72-volt, 100-amp-hour battery pack. Once fully charged, this battery unit can provide up to 150 miles of riding at speeds below 28 miles per hour. Please note that the bike is capable of reaching the top speed of 65 miles per hour, but riding at higher speeds drains the battery at a much higher rate. This bike will be brought to the market with a quirky nameplate, the Stash. The reason for the name could be explained by a generous amount of storage that the bike offers, so you can stash away all your motorcycling essentials in one place. After launching their first mini bike in Europe and Asia last year, the Taiwanese Tromax is ready to present another electric motorcycle that it hopes to import to the United States in 2022. Quite compact in size, the Yuko S has similar styling to the Mino sibling, but boasts a healthy boost in performance and agility. Instead of producing just 2.2 kilowatt, its mid mounted electric motor now peaks at 7 kilowatts, while its torque rating increases to 150 pound feet. These figures are enough to propel the 240-pound bike to its top speed of 62 miles per hour in 4.2 seconds. The model also easily climbs 22-degree slopes, gets additional ABS and CBS systems, and packs a 4-kilowatt-hour blade battery. Finally, it comes outfitted with a longer seat and rear foot pegs, suggesting two-passenger capability.
Electric Motion is a French motorcycle manufacturer that despite its short history of existence, has already earned a reputation among EV fans, thanks to their lineup of off-road ready and trial models. This year, the manufacturer is launching upgrades to their lineup and is trying to acquaint even more motorcycling enthusiasts with the benefits of electric motors and the thrills of getting an almost instantaneous flow of power and torque. The brand's latest trial motorbike is called E-Pure and is equipped with a 6-kilowatt electric motor. The rider has three power modes to choose from. The most powerful mode can push enough electricity through the motor to generate 11 kilowatt of peak power. According to the manufacturer, the E-Pure is one of the lightest models in its class. This fact makes the bike's torque parameters, that is 442.5 pound-feet, sound even more impressive. The 2022 model year marked the introduction of such features as a progressive regenerative brake, a progressive electronic lever switch, and traction control system. The E-Pure model is shipped with a standard 15-amp charger that can top the 50.4-volt, 1,875-watt-hour battery unit to the full in about three hours. The faster 25-amp quick charger is available as an option, and its use case can slash the charging time to just two hours. Once back on the road, you can enjoy up to 25 miles of riding at speeds close to 44 miles per hour. For the 2022 model year, the company also upgraded the Escape model, it's a touring bike that has the same chassis and engine as E-Pure, but comes equipped with a larger battery pack. This is a 50.4 volt unit with a 2,690 watt hour of capacity and can provide up to 37 miles of riding. When it comes to electric bikes, zero motorcycles don't need an introduction. This company has been manufacturing commuter and dual sport bikes for a decade now. They've been doing it so well that the brand is currently considered to be one of the leaders in the industry. This year, they've announced an update to their SRF model. It's one of their most powerful models to date. This electric street fighter uses a smart 110 horsepower motor that lets you unleash 140 pounds feet of instant torque. It gets an upgraded Z-Force battery pack that's good for 161 miles of riding in the city. When the power tank option is used, the range could be extended to 200 miles on the city streets and 100 on the highway. The bike supports level 2 charging technology, gets a fully adjustable Showa suspension, advanced Bosch MSC, and J1 brakes. The company didn't want to stop here and has unveiled a limited edition version of the SRF bike called the Quick Strike. This motorcycle will be produced in a run of just 100 units. As a way to show respect to the SRF's strong performance at the Pikes Peak Hill Climbing Challenge, this model received a series of exterior changes, additional elements, and upgrades to the parts that are now made of carbon fiber. The list of all upgrades could be looked up on the company's official website. RM1 is the first creation by this UK-based motorcycle manufacturer. Their lightweight electric motorcycle has been designed with an effort to preserve British motoring heritage, while at the same time offering a great deal of innovations. Despite looking like a lightweight bike, the RM1 possesses specifications that are inherent to electric mopeds. Like many mopeds that are commonly used for getting around the city, the RM1 is equipped with an electric motor capable for reaching the speeds of up to 45 miles per hour. The moped's base model is equipped with a one battery pack good for about 40 miles of continuous riding. Those who need to travel for longer distances can purchase the second battery pack, thus doubling the estimated range. The bike's battery packs can be removed for your charging convenience, and the RM1 bike can be recharged from a standard power outlet. It should be noted that the first edition production run of this e-motorcycle has already been sold out. If you're considering the purchase of one of these two-wheelers, you can join the manufacturer's queue and get your delivery in 2022. Four years of engineering efforts by a company from Poland have resulted in the creation of Nuba One. It's a powerful electric bike that is destined to serve a dual purpose, provide an electric alternative to the fans of motocross bikes or be used as a regular bicycle with power restricted for city riding. The switch between city and off-road modes is said to be quick and effortless. 
Nuba One motorbike is offered in two power modifications. The higher spec model is equipped with an 18 kilowatt electric motor, while the cheaper modification gets a 10 kilowatt unit. Both modifications come with a 56 amp hour battery, which can offer up to 130 miles of continuous riding. The top speed of these bikes is limited to 68 miles per hour. The company is currently looking for ways to fund production of this e-motorbike. If you believe in the future of this model, you can place a pre-order today and receive your two-wheeler in one of three available colors, blue, red, or black. Autobike Group is a Taiwanese electric vehicle manufacturer that's known for their small electric motorcycles that are already on sale in Europe. In order to raise awareness of their e-motorcycle lineup, this manufacturer has brought their product range to the latest Milan motorcycle show. Apart from the production-ready range, Autobike Group has unveiled three concept models that we'd like to briefly review. Auto MXR is a dirt trail bike with a striking rugged design. Owing to the bike's lightweight construction, the overall weight would be just 240 pounds. The installed electric motor is said to produce a hefty amount of torque, 23.6 pound-feet to be exact, and is good for electrified sprints to the top speed of 62 miles per hour. The next model on the brand's exhibition stand was the CTX Maxi Scooter. Besides equipping the model with a powerful 15 kilowatt electric motor, the company decided to give it bold styling with dual LED headlights in the front a storage box that can fit your helmet, and a rich set of technological features that can be accessed through a large TFT display. Finally, CR21 is the brand's vision of a cafe racer motorcycle of tomorrow. This two-wheeler has classic cues carefully blended with modern design elements. The battery and powertrain specifications are yet to be revealed, but Autobike representatives promise that the bike's 11 kilowatt motor will show performance comparative to the standard 300cc motorbike. We would really like to hear your opinion about the lineup in the comments section. Don't forget to mention other exciting models that we may have missed. Rate the video with a like, subscribe to the channel, and ring that bell. More exciting EV content is on the screen. Just follow the links. See you soon.